starting. Check it out. Oh, they're gonna show it? Let's go! Who is it? Who is it? Now, is it a returning or new to the series? Let's see. God damn it. I know it. Oh, what the hell? Giovanna? Hey, brand new! Alrighty! A new character to the series! Uh, first off, I'm love. Ah, <laughs> she got a fro too! Oh, no, that's from Faust, but holy... And she fights with the wolf, so she's basically a cooler version of Yamcha! Oh my god, so we get two new characters outside of Nako. Giovanna. It looks beautiful though, I ain't gonna front. I like it, I like what I see. If the characters will be available in the initial roster, so we gain two more. <laughs> uh oh. Uh... Holy shit! I... That's be Anji. That's Anji. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. Oh wow. That's that was Anji. Ah, so we got a new character here. Well, two characters revealed, I guess, but. Why don't we start talking about the first one, Giovanna. Giovanna. I'm crazy, let's go! So this is like a completely brand new character, Giovanna. I can't even tell, is she a black or... Oh, she looks good. Oh, and she's got a police badge, so... Character has uh, attaching attack, which they can cancel up as their main move. Um, very similar to Jam. That's what I'm noticing right there. So she's kind of jam ass. I just noticed in the trailer. Yeah. Um, the character is mostly an infighting rushdown character. Um, she also has a very strong cross up attack. It's my style. Hey, look at all these martial arts kicks right here. And uh, what's with the wolf that she got right here? First off, that intro is badass. I love that. <laughs> the fact that she flips in Crescent or looks like some type of wolf. <laughs> wolf spirit. Lucky! <laughs> Me lucky. You know, I'm a sucker for female fighters, so, uh, hey, we got one to the collection. Not what I expected, though, but hey. Yeah, she looks good. <laughs> Her job is that she's the bodyguard for the U.S. president. <laughs> Oh yeah, U.S. agent slash bodyguard for the U.S. president. Alrighty. But can you explain the wolf? <laughs> I guess it's TBD in regards of her lore, but uh, so far, me like see. Me like see. Alrighty, so we're going to play the Giovanna trailer uh, once more and definitely get a little more insights as to what she's uh, capable of in regards of uh, it looks like she's gonna be uh, as they just described uh, in the stream uh, massive rushdown character and uh, definitely a brand new uh, wife of material so uh, <laughs> let's uh, play the trailer once more let's go <laughs> And of course, we see all the characters that got revealed, and uh, this waifu material right here. What's that Jackie Chan shit right here? It's hot Yamcha! <laughs> To get the theme, if this is her actual theme right here, <laughs> it definitely fits uh, her Wolfang fist style right here in regards of her footwork and uh, the fact that she carries a uh, wolf around her. Is that like a spirit or something right there? <laughs> she got the back foot kicks and everything. <laughs> Holy hell! Mm. 
nuts, nuts, nuts. Uh, very nuts, very nuts. Let's play it again. Let's play it again. That part. Oh yeah, she's definitely gonna be new waifu material for sure! <laughs> now my question is, I wonder if she embodies herself as a wolf considering that she has a, a wolf spirit right here. And basically she's all footwork technique, so I wonder if she's Taekwondo or... Yeah, so basically she's giving uh, Valkenheim vibes, uh, mainly with footwork. I'm loving the mix-ups, I'm loving the rushdowns, and I'm definitely loving her look in particular. How you doing, Giovanna? <laughs> definitely giving uh, Streets of Rage vibes. Uh, and the fact that she's a freaking bodyguard for the U.S. president, that's crazy. Any human hunter, I hope you clean out the cum all over your... <laughs> See you in the next trailer in the new years. Uh, I played the 1010 theme with the fan denzeling down and... Uh, uh, let's fill him in, try quick. Back, motherfuckers! The Resident Thief is back, motherfuckers, and it looks like it's on a new stage as well. I can definitely tell that as well, so, uh... <laughs> from the look at the shadows, uh, very nice designs. Uh, basically, all the Guilty Gear Strive designs have been mad futuristic as uh, basically a lot of shit that they, they have to wear, so that makes them super heavy, but at the same time, it's just uh, state of the art in regards of uh, their characters and their personas right there. And Anji right here? I remember playing him in X2 and Ancient Core and all the other games. Uh, He's gonna be nuts! <laughs> so, I guess we'll have to wait until uh, January, basically at New Year's Day, uh, to get the full uh, gameplay and see what he's capable of. But, uh, why can't I talk? I'm just too hot for this game right here. Not only because of Anji, this waifu material right here, which I'm about to show you one more time. <laughs> Oh. Sorry, I gotta pause. I'm sorry. The lips, the hair, the blue Mary Bob uh, that they just gave her, and this wolf. Just look at this, huh? Now, uh, the spiritual wolf right here, I think we'll get more insight in regards to that, but, uh, them nails, girl. <laughs> Don't forget about them nails. And, uh, I'll let Cress the star compliment on her face as well. Your makeup, huh? Yeah, basically, uh, the emblem uh, of the wolf. I wonder if, uh, she correlates uh, to Zappa in a way in regards of the heart shape, but, uh, that's to be determined, but anyway. Portrait for us all. Portrait, portrait for us all. <laughs> Hashtag day one meme. Let's see what else I got. So yeah, definitely loving the... Yeah, she got the spirit of the wolf just guarding all of uh, Poltigan's attacks right here, as you see right here. Pretty cool. This dash with some rushdown attacks. I love the drop kick right there. And we got the battle of some 
Can't really call her a puppet master because basically uh, she uses the spirit of the wolf to basically <laughs> progress uh, some of her kicks. And now that I think about her uh, design with those uh, heavy baggy pants, uh, do you guys remember Poopa from uh, Rage of the Dragons? Yeah, the one that does capoeira that also fights uh, with a freaking screwdriver and a wrench. <laughs> yeah, that's what this uh, scheme uh, right here uh, definitely uh, reminds me of in regards of uh, what she has uh, in store in regards uh, to her little scheme right here as far as her design and everything. Which does look dope and you can tell right there uh, she's all about the business right there. She's got to make sure the President of the United States uh, aka not Donald Trump <laughs> is uh, secured uh, from all of these uh, gears and these uh, anomalies. But anyway continue! You know any type of leg throws is gangsters right there, and, uh, freaking like- Oh my god, this adorableness right here! THIS ADORABLENESS RIGHT HERE! I mean, I'm not the biggest fan of pets and alls, but this uh, adorable cuteness right here. May pen the dolphins and G. Elvana pen her wolf that basically will <laughs> definitely mess uh, May up in a bit. I'll continue. Oh, yeah, I'm definitely gonna day one her for sure. On top of Milia, so. Uh, American Wolf, uh, Giovanna, <laughs> coming to Kilti Gear Strive, and uh, we got an official date. It's going to be April 9th uh, for PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5, so can't wait to try her out as well as... Anji Mito, which we'll see more about him in 2021, so anyway... <laughs> <laughs> Arxis, you definitely, uh, definitely know how to step up the wife of games in regards to, to these brand new characters. Uh, <laughs> Giovanna right there takes the game. I don't want to call her a jam substitute because uh, the potential of having jam versus Giovanna with, uh, Jam with her dragon style, uh, the thousand years of uh, Chinese martial arts versus uh, whatever the fuck uh, footsy uh, style that uh, Giovanna has uh, with her wolf thing. Not so uh, this style is <laughs> definitely gonna implement well in this game. So can't wait to uh, definitely go down into her lore and see what more mechanics we can do with her because as they just described in the screen, massive brush downs, which hey, it's my style. And, uh, hey, uh, the fact that she gives me, uh, freaking... <laughs> what is that Law & Order show? Uh, <laughs> SBU vibe. That's the vibe I begin from her in regards of uh, her presentation. It's like Blue Mary Bob. And basically, she does have the badge letting her know that, hey, she's above the law and she knows how to run this shit. And she's also about the BLM stuff so because, uh, she better recognize you better not come for those who I think against, but anyways, so, <laughs> yeah, we gotta wait till uh, April the 9th uh, to play this game out, and, uh, yeah, just like everybody says all over the world, <laughs> day one main, day one main, I don't think it's gonna be Amelia for me, but uh, I don't give a fuck, day one main for me, so, um, so yeah, we're gonna get her, we're gonna get Anji, and we're gonna get, uh, one more character for the base roster, um, who will that base roster character will be? Uh, uh, you can leave it in my uh, video comments uh, down below. And um, uh, on top of that, that they did announce a season pass, which will also include uh, five more uh, characters that will join the fray once uh, <laughs> this uh, game uh, dies down after launch. So, uh, so there's gonna be like 20 total after uh, the first season is done. Uh, Post launch that is, so um, if uh, none of my favorites make it to the main roster, hopefully 
they are one of the five, uh, or two of the five, depending on who I want back. Jim and Parkin, but uh, a sudden point. But anyway, we got a lot of shit that's coming with us, Strive, and I'm glad uh, the developers uh, took their time in regards of uh, making sure this game is top notch. Um, I know uh, because of COVID, all development teams are basically slowed down to the point of uh, making sure the game is just top notch outside of the beta, but. Uh, Besides the point, um, we got an official date, and we know what's uh, to come uh, for Guilty Gear Strive. Now the question is, is it going to be a cross-up play as far as Gen play? Well, I think they should because uh, XArt is cross-play uh, Gen play with uh, PS3 and PS4 because it also came out on PS3 uh, as well. So, uh, yeah, I can't wait for that. So, uh, the question is, can they do some cross-play with uh, PS4 and Steam? That's TBD, but until then, um, uh, just uh, leave the comments on what you think about, uh, potentially, uh, <laughs> uh Finding Games' new white boo, uh, and, uh, Anji uh, joining the roster on top of that. Uh, I know Human Hunter is still cleaning up, uh, his, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna leave him alone because I love you, but anyways, uh, but, uh, you know, he's about fan-type characters, so, <laughs> but anyways, uh, just, uh, whatever you thought about Giovanna and Naji, and what's more to come and strive, just leave the comments down below, uh, share the videos with your friends, like on it, and do the Julia Chang, and don't forget to subscribe! So yeah, what be ninja, now this month? Cannot wait till this bullshit gets crazy and definitely smell the game uh, when we start to guilty or strive uh, come 2021. Later's.